Hello, my Libras. This is your daily for the 19th through the 20th. Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. If you guys are new, welcome to the channel. Please hit the like button, share the video, and subscribe. We have love and accept yourself. Thank you, angels, for lovingly guiding me to self-acceptance. That's right. <laughs> All right, what other messages do we have for my Libras? Libras. Queen of Wands. All right, now. Like it. King of Pentacles. Hmm. What else? The Eight of Swords. Huh. Hmm. <laughs> Now, I see two situations here instantly. The first one is that um, I think that you guys try to be, not really that you try to be, but sometimes you can be a little, you know, over the top, maybe a little fiery, maybe like, you know, lashing out maybe doing a few little vindictive things um but then you know that's when you kind of get somebody really gets under your skin is when you start like doing things like that but you know usually you know you're a lot more calm um you know you're you're there regardless with the people that you love but when somebody irks the crap out of you it's like you take your hands off and it's like you do it yourself you know that type of thing or you know you just like um you engage a whole lot more in a very fiery maybe like you know lashing out sort of thing okay um but and i think you struggle with that I think you struggle with that because I don't think that you really like to be the type of person that kind of lashes out, um, you know, gets out of your element, gets upset. I don't think you like to be that kind of person. I think you like to be more chill here, here and not really let people know that things are bothering you. But let me tell you that, you know, nobody's nobody's like even keel all the time. You know, we have our good things about us we have our not so good things about us but you know it makes us who we are so i think you know loving and accepting yourself is is you know really what this is pushing you to do accepting that yeah if you get mad you have you know you have every right to get mad if something pisses you off you know and then when when it doesn't then you come back down and you kind of calm down a little bit but i think you guys probably have a pretty decent mixture of you know letting people know when they step on your toes and then when they are not stepping on your toes okay i'm back to my chill nature <laughs> i mean you know what i'm saying so that is the first scenario now for others of you this is you guys really not wanting to like you like somebody I think you're attracted to this person but I think that you feel like um, that you don't have all of their attention maybe they're caught up in something else here that's got their attention and um, you guys also are like bothered by this. I think this is something that you guys are sharing for different reasons. Both of you are like, you know, trapped in your own heads, thinking about things, replaying things even. Um, this person is way more like, um, you know, want to be at home, want to want to just be around family maybe watch some tv you know this is not a person that really likes to go a whole lot and then you have this other person over here that likes to go it's like you guys are are, are different okay you guys are different and i think that there's something about this person um that really does not sit well with you because you don't have all of their attention. They're looking off somewhere. 
okay so you know whichever one is you but there there is somebody here that you feel like I feel or they feel like you they don't have your attention they feel like you're all in your head but they're all in their head thinking about you being all in yours I mean you know it's like both of you are bothered by a situation here where one of your um, one of you your attention is also somewhere else okay let's see why this is happening hmm we have the Empress here we have the Ace of Wands we have the Knight of Cups. Somebody sees like a great, like great potential with you, my Libras. They really are attracted to you. They feel like you are everything that they could want. And they probably have spoken that to you. Not sure if you really believe that. Because they're getting you feel like their attention is elsewhere. So, I mean, I think you're taking this with whatever they're saying to you as some bull crap. But I think this person gen genuinely has feelings for you. I really do. Okay. Let's see. What else? What's the influence here? Hmm. Leo energy. Somebody's trying to be strong enough. I mean, it's like, hmm. <laughs> Somebody's trying to figure their their way out of this. Um, whatever whatever the worry is here, it's really bothering, and I feel like it's bothering the both of you. I feel like this is a weight that both of you are carrying, and both of you are trying to figure out, you know, how to how to fix this situation, how to make this situation better. Both of you. Somebody's probably trying to figure out how to get you to see that um, their eyes are not somewhere else. And you're really trying to figure out, you know, is this person telling the truth? Something like that. Okay. So let's see what the advice is for you guys here. You guys are in a pickle. Hmm. The advice for you is to use your intuition to um, figure your way out of this, actually. Um, whatever you are feeling intuitively, um, instinctually within you, um, go with that. Go with your intuition because, you know, your intuition is right. Whatever that may be, whatever makes you feel, you know, whatever makes you feel like you, you are doing the right thing. Okay. Go with that. All right, my guys, I will speak with you soon.